guys, this is David. Welcome back to my channel. Hey, I'm gonna do a quick uh, overview of the new update that just came out. Um, it just downloaded, I think yesterday on my car. So uh, again, I have the 2021 Model Y Performance right there, wrapped in khaki green. So uh, without further ado, let's take you inside the car and uh, let's go over the, uh, the few new uh, cool new features. All right, guys, so now we're in the release notes. So uh, as you can see here, these uh, this can be found. If you don't know where your release notes at, is at, let me get out of this, and I'll show you. You go to your main car button way over here to the left, right here, and where it says software, and then you scroll down to where it says the latest release notes off the update right there. So hit release notes takes a second to uh, populate. So here's the 2021.24.4. So and these are all the new items that came in this. So it looks like we have Disney Plus. We have the car wash mode, mirror auto dim, the dash cam improvements, range display, remain connected to Wi-Fi and drive, and then the new language support. So. Uh, Disney Plus, super cool. If you like, uh, if you have an account with Disney Plus, uh, if you guys don't know where to go, go there. I can show you real fast. I'm sure most of you know, but obviously this is going to be in your entertainment section and under theater. And right there is Disney Plus. So if you have an account, you select it, it's going to load, and then you add in what uh, your account information is. Super cool. So. Let's go back to where we were on the release notes. Always takes a second for it to load up. And so the next line item, this is the one I'm more uh, excited about, car wash mode. So for those that know, don't know what car wash mode is, it's it actually closes all the windows, locks the charging port, which for those that clean their cars themselves, I guess, and if you go to a car wash, it keeps that stupid door from keep opening. Every time I wash my car, the port always <laughs> opens, opens. And then I've always set, I've set the alarm off several times on my car when I'm washing it. Um, I've had windows that's rolled down while I'm washing it. Um, so this is uh, hopefully a mode that uh, fixes a lot of those issues. But um, but yeah, uh, it fixes the, the parking sensor, the chimes, and it tells you right here for automatic car washers that has conveyor belts, the free roll option shifts to neutral and prevents the parking brake from automatically applying, which is super cool. And then where to go to do that. So it's gonna be in controls and service car wash mode. So let's go there. So it's right here, it says service. And then if you can see, there's where the car wash mode is. So it's in that service um, menu and then car wash mode and you select it. And then it's going to tell you that it's going to lock all windows, doors, and disable the windshield wipers. It's going to disable sentry mode, walk away door locks, and all those good things. So um, I'm going to be super excited about that. I uh, haven't got a chance to try it yet, but I will soon because I'm going to be washing my car. So let's go to the next line item. Oh, there we go. Mirror auto dim. So you can now enable or disable automatic dimming in your mirrors. So uh, that's also a super cool feature. So again, it's a controls, mirror, and auto dim. So we're gonna go back to main controls. Um, go to oh, mirrors right here. And then right in there is the mirror auto dim. You can turn it off and on. So super easy, super cool there. And then dashboard improvements just says it saves clips. Now you can go in and um, change it. So uh, it says right here, if you have an accident or airbag deployment, recordings can be stored um, locally. So it's given an, a, an X amount of time uh, before and after, let's say an accident that's gonna auto store. Um, so you just go on safety and security right here and scroll down um, to you got dash cam auto 
Is where we're at. Yeah. I should do that right. Safety security dash cam. Yeah. So you make a dash cam to auto. That's right. So safety security. Let's go down and make sure that's on auto. So there's that one. And then let's go range mode. Now, I actually am excited about range display. Um, as simple as that is, because I was <laughs> had to decide one week to the next. Do I want to use miles or do I want to use range uh, or percentage? So now, simply just tap it right here where the where the uh, battery is. So right now it says I'm at 74%. And now I just tap it. And it says I'm at 208 miles at 74%. Tap it again. goes back and forth. Super cool. I like that so much better because now I can just go back and forth because sometimes it's nice to know your percentage as well as how many miles you have left. So, and okay, here we go. Remain connected to Wi-Fi. So what that means is if you're using a hotspot, um, so versus like when you're pulling out from your driveway, let's say you're on your home Wi-Fi or hotspot, um, it doesn't disconnect. Uh, I don't use that, so that's not going to pertain to me, but it allows you to stay connected uh, like I said, it says especially useful for users who wish to use the hotspots for connectivity. So, and then last is new language support. And there are the new languages, um, Hungarian, Romanian, and Russian um, has been added to the language support. So, super cool. Again, guys, I'm more excited about the probably the car wash mode than any of them. And the range display is probably my second favorite. Hey guys, that's it for today. Hope you liked the video. I know it's a short one. Uh, leave me in comments down below and uh, make sure you guys subscribe. Got some real, real, really cool videos coming out in the very, very near future. Uh, if you haven't seen the one I just did with my drone, uh, it's the sunset photo shoot. It's actually pretty cool. Not really me in it, just my car, <laughs> but it is pretty cool. Uh, if you like um, cool scenery shots. So until next time, guys, uh, we'll see you on the next one. See ya.